Guys, it has arrived. Schwank. The most important package that I will receive this year has come to me courtesy of FedEx. Hiding the addresses. Um, so, the story behind this package, for those of you who may not have kept up with my uh, Instagram or Facebook recently, is that um, Freefly Systems, represent, has recently come out with a new product called the Movi, which is slightly confusing because they've had a million other products called the Movi, but this one is a gimbal for your iPhone. Um, and so one of our friends over there, Brian, was talking on Facebook, I don't know if I can find the thread again, but was saying that whoever from our group ordered a Movi first would get a California burrito for ordering the Movi. So, um, Who's your boy got their movie ordered first? And this should be the most joyful California burrito that I ever did see. So the first response is that it it smells like ice and maybe like a burrito. We have some black ice, one of these sort of insulating bags. Pull out all these ice packs. So Brian shipped this yesterday, overnighted it. Ooh, we have some little little salsa containers. These appear to have held together pretty well, which is impressive. I'm not gonna bother opening that yet. And then we have the moment of truth with this here actual burrito. Um, first thought is that it definitely seems frozen. Second thought is that it's actually relatively intact. Let's see, it's definitely a little, little smooshed up, um, but it looks okay. So I'm gonna try and, I don't know if I should just, I feel like I gotta heat this bad boy up. So take this box, take it out of the way. We're gonna go throw this bad boy in the oven. I feel like an important part of this conversation is uh, talking about the actual movie and why I ordered one. Um, so the, this new movie basically seems to be designed to fit in between the other movies. Um, so they sort of had their original, uh, gosh, their original offering, which was the movie. Um, the Movi M5, M10, and M15, and those were sort of small, medium, large, and uh, allowed you to tackle different size camera packages. But now the new offering is the Movi, which is the phone one, the Movi Pro, which is their uh, newer upgraded one for cinema cameras, and then the Movi XL, which is their big gimbal for cars and planes and trains and all that kind of crazy stuff. So the reason that I got a Movi, the phone Movi, is because I like filming behind the scenes a lot, I travel a lot, and though I have this ADD, um, which is great for stuff like this, it can be a little bit of a pain to have to pack another camera sometimes, and so I'm hoping that the movie will be a good option that I can just sort of throw in my backpack, have on planes with me, and I can film more vlog type footage, and hopefully that I'll feel less awkward, because honestly, sometimes I still haven't gotten used to like talking to a camera walking around an airport, um, so I'm not very good at this outside of my own home. I'm not even very good at it in my own home, but I'm interested to see sort of how the new movie will allow me to get some more different stuff. It's also great for filming motion time lapses, and it has a lot of cool features. I highly recommend you check it out, but for the like $300 I believe that it costs, it's hard to beat it. So. I'm excited to have one. Um, I'm hoping to get a Movi Pro at some point soon, but that will require me getting a camera that is not the Amira, so we'll see when that actually happens. But uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm really excited about the Movi. I think it's gonna be cool. I don't have any um, sort of delusions about it becoming my new primary cinematography tool or anything, but for um, behind the scenes stuff, travel stuff, vlogging, and just sort of having for fun even, honestly, just going and filming time lapses when we're on vacation, whatever, it's a cool little tool to have, and I'm excited to see what they do with it. So hopefully I'll have one in hand soon and can do sort of a more exhaustive review and test with my iPhone 10. but if you have any questions about the movie, I'm really interested to hear them, so feel free to put those in the comments below and uh, yeah if you ordered one I'd love to, to know why you did and sort of what you're looking forward to using it for and I think that's about it for now I'm just gonna wait on this burrito to warm up for a second
and burrito. Now for the final test, we'll see how good a California burrito overnighted in the middle of a New England bomb storm is. Oh, it's hot and tasty. Well, I'm gonna work on finishing this bad boy. Shout out to Brian for overnighting me a burrito. It's the craziest thing someone has ever done. Um, if you want to ship me stuff and have me open it and eat it on camera, uh, the other high level winner here is um, my friend Jason sent me a bottle of Patron once because he was a Patreon supporter and I called him Patron so he sent me Patron so that was pretty sweet so I'm just saying if you send me stuff I'll take it but uh, thank you guys so much for watching like I said interested to hear your thoughts on the movie excited to get mine in as always if you like this channel go check out the podcast supersecretfilmcast.com and if you want more detailed insight into how and why I do what I do go to patreon.com slash eborse here support all this stuff and get access to bonus content I love you guys and I'll see you all soon bye